real clutch of players almost on the goal line here, waiting for this delivery from Booty. Deep ball over towards Alul again, who was certainly the target for both of those corners. Lawson it was who got in the way. Weston, who was so effective cutting in from this side in the reverse fixture. That's how he scored his goal. Robinson, the dagger's looking dangerous here. Taylor with the chance to cross. It's far too close to Barton from a dagger's perspective. Josh Hare. Sagas. Weston. Left by Ransom. Barton will take it on. And he's clean through. What a chance for Maystone to take the lead. But he couldn't finish it. Good save that by Justin. He went to ground at just the right time, but what a chance that was for Maidstone. All of the daggers are making, though. It's a terrible mistake, you know. I think Rance is probably too far. He tries to stretch to, to get there, but the pass is in great back. But then no one switches on. You know, when Barham goes through there, you expect him to be able to, to dispatch this. He's clean through. He probably has too much time. Yeah, he probably has too much time on his hands there. Justin closes the distance really well. And just like in the first game, when he makes a brilliant save right at the death, comes up with a huge save there as well. Spided his time and then waited the ball to Saga beautifully. And then Lou got something on it. And Robinson played it back and Walker hit it! Only just wide. The setup there for Walker was brilliant. And it's only just been kept out. Where it's really good play because what Weston does, Weston comes to the ball so Sagath can go down the outside. And then once the ball's played in, Robinson, he sees Walker's there free. Walker tries to go for the bottom corner, but really good block, and, and now they've got the corner for it. Weston will take it. Plenty of pace on that delivery, and it almost came through to Long Kink. Good bit of pressure there, so Walker's there again! And this time it's in! Walker for the Daggers! Denied on that first occasion. But now he's on the score sheet just seconds later. Well, now, this could be interesting. Well, straight away, the Maidstone players did appeal. And the referee now, Matt Russell, has gone across to speak to his assistant. Sean Farrer and Chris Myatt are the assistant referees today. Big moment in the game, this. Well, the, the, linesman, ha the linesman has to be sure there. You know, um, I didn't know, I don't know whether or not he put his flag up straight away to, to indicate that, that Walker was offside, but, you know, we'll see here. It did look like it was offside. Oh, I'm not too sure. I don't, I don't think even the linesman can be totally sure there. Walker puts it away really well, but I think that Darrell will, you know, he'll feel aggrieved because I'm not sure if there is a touch, you know, onto Walker there. Robinson's turn well. Referees allowed the advantage. Robinson with the shots. Marias, who thought about it for a moment. Might think again, he did! So oh, and he forced a great save! Good stop that by Barton, really travelling from Marias. It's a brilliant strike from Marias, and this is what Maidstone can't afford to do. You can't afford to let Marias get himself facing the goal and unleash shots, because he's got a vicious strike when he, when he really catches hold of it. Field out wide, this might be a decoy, we'll see. Into the box it goes. And it's flicked on and too far wide, the header from the skipper, Robinson. is on his way. Sagaf arriving on the edge of the box, Walker was already in there, Marias goes down. Big appeals for a penalty. And they're not going to get one. Well, Marias is incensed here. Well, it looked a stonewall penalty for me. You know, Marias has cut inside. There's clearly contact and he's gone down. For me, that's an absolute stonewall penalty. Yeah. The referee's got a really good, good view of it as well. I can't understand why he's not, why he's not pointed to the to the penalty spot. Securing possession in in those forward areas. Oh, Walker allow. could be in here. 
It's a good save, again, from Barton, who had a very good first half, but he's kept out Walker there at the start of the second. From Fowler. Taylor. Towards Marias! So his reaction suggests he thinks that was a decent chance. Josh Hare. Sagaf. Sagaf! Great chance, and I don't think he was too far away there either. He wasn't far away at all, and it's really good take there. He touches it. As he lets it go, it looks brilliant in flight. You know, you think that's just going to nestle in the in the top left-hand corner, and it's just a little bit wide, and, and unfortunately for him, it, it goes wide, but really good positioning and really good strike from Sagaf. Vincent now for the Daggers. Alul got enough on it to get it away from Marias. Saunders, again he looks for Marias, the angle's tight! And it's kept off the line almost. Well, for once, the goalkeeper was beaten, but Fowler was there to stop it going in. Be a big miss in the closing stages here as well, Ben and Williams. They've got to defend this set piece without him. Oh, and off the post it came. Really good header that by Long King. So close to the opener for the Daggers. You're watching Segaf chasing him back there, and you, just for a moment, I'm thinking, don't do anything stupid. You're already on a yellow card. Marias. Miles Weston on the outside. Brilliant cross! Fantastic goal! Walker with it, and finally the deadlock is broken. What a cross that was from Weston, and Walker did the rest. They've done so well. 82 minutes, they've done so well in, in limiting how much Weston has an influence, but brilliant ball. You know, he just bends it in between, in between the defence and, and the goalkeeper. You know, that corridor of uncertainty, as they call it. And Walker does brilliantly. He finds it, he gets ahead of his man, Diving header, really, really good finish from Walker. And puts Dagenham 1 0 up, and it's nothing less than they deserve. It gets a free kick on the edge of the box. You expect your free kick taker to step up. That is a waste and a missed opportunity.